Alexander. I'm uh, 59, and uh, I'm a marketing guy for a cybersecurity firm. So the first time I came to Gig Lane, I was just a few years old. My granddad, um, Arthur Ashworth, was a huge Shakers fan. And so he brought my cousins once in a while, and as a baby, really, I came, because my granddad was a big fan of Colin Bell. And so he brought me to Gig Lane as a kid to see Colin Bell. Now, I remember later on coming, when it was still, it was still standing in the stadium, uh, I remember that more vividly, but the first time I came was uh, at a game to see Colin Bell. You know, I, I don't have a favorite season per se. I just remember in the 1970s, you know, that was the time when I was coming on a regular basis. And uh, any of those seasons were just classic because I was with my granddad, you know, with family, go to the cemetery to see my great grandparents before coming here. You know, th those are magical moments in your life. My favorite player would still be Colin Bell, just because, uh, you know, we followed him when he went to Manchester City after Barry. You know, because uh, at the time we lived in Gorton, so we could go to Main Road or we could come to uh, Gig Lane to see Barry. But Colin Bell was, you know, one of the classics of all time, and I was lucky enough to see him when I was a kid. I have, um, I have a, one of the shirts with birthdays on the front that I actually wear when I'm skiing, because I got a big one, so it goes over my ski jacket. I still wear it today. In fact, I was wearing it over Christmas. And a lot of people ask me about that. So the novelty of it, I guess, is, uh, is what I like. But, you know, we're looking forward to seeing a lot of great new shirts as we get started again. I don't remember who the game was against, but I remember being here with my granddad. Um, it was a solid 4-0 win. Everyone was really happy. You know, a resounding, thumping triumph. You know, one of those games where every one of the goals stretches the net. Uh, and, uh, you know, that, that was just... That was just magic. Sorry, I don't remember which one it was. So, you know, to me, Barry FC is, is legacy, is family, and, uh, you know, it's, it's history. And uh, as I've gotten older, I've really, you know, become more connected to Barry FC in many respects. And, uh, you know, I, I have memories of people that are no longer with us that uh, are brought back by Barry FC. So, uh, you know, as a community, it, it matters, and, uh, and that's why it's so important to me now. To all of the fans in Barry, all of people who are fans of football in Barry, I really hope we can come together. I think we all have a shared past, and I hope we have a shared future. There's a lot of good things we can do together. You know, we can be a good-sized club with no debt in its own stadium. Uh, and, uh, and really make good things happen for the community here and, uh, and make some new football history together. So I really hope we can move beyond some of the recent divisions and, uh, and come together. Uh, that's what I really hope for.